Good morning, Weather First Meteorologist Gary Frank with an update on another sunny day. Warmer conditions this morning. What a big difference a day makes as we start to see things feel more like spring. And that's going to be the case over the next few days as we started off 51 degrees today. Many other spots even outside of the city, even in the mid 40s, a little cooler in Chesterfield in the valley, still above freezing. That's going to be the trend the next few days as this warmer weather continues. Our current temperatures have already soared into the mid to upper 60s as we look area wide. It's all part of a system that this front right here, this warm front may create a few storms for areas off to the west later on, but otherwise we're dry and we're warm the rest of the day. Temperatures staying into the mid to upper 70s. It's going to be very pleasant outside. That wind continues to pick up out of the southwest. Now into the overnight hours, there is a severe weather risk off to the west as a result of this warm front that lifts to the north and the timing of this. This is a very low end severe threat, at least at this point. But I want to point it out because I think there are some areas for development here uh, overall for the rest of the day, though temperatures continue to warm up. And I think what we're going to look at here into the overnight hours is as storms develop there, we're going to watch a few areas uh, start to work their wind by midnight. There may be a, a pop up shower storm as this starts to fall apart. You'll notice the general trend is for this to weaken. That's something to look out for. I think most of us miss out once again on some of this rain and Wednesday is mostly dry and much calmer. So overall, I think you're going to look at temperatures that continue to stay on the mild side. Mid 70s things clear out. I think Thursday is our better opportunity as we're under a slight risk. Portions of Herman, Bowling Green, Pike County, Gasconade, Rolla, Sullivan as well under that slight risk and that's due to the timing of this front as it starts to settle in. You'll notice by Wednesday we see the northern portion of the front lift north not out of the question for showers and storms late in the day as that lifts north but I think it's the second half as that front settles in by Thursday morning still mild as the main front settles in storms develop ahead of that in central Missouri and that's where I think we may see some marginal wind threats and maybe some larger hail otherwise temperatures in the mid to upper 70s a chance especially early that falls apart and then we're going to see a few storms before that rain moves south temperatures cool down then we head into the weekend dry, cooler, and even back in the mid-40s.